Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name's Tay. If you're new here, don't forget to follow me on my other socials. I go live on TikTok and Twitch every weekend and I post weekly on TikTok as well. So the last we saw of Genevieve, she actually got smoked out by Emmett and she got high for the first time. They had some munchies and she passed out on his couch. So it's the next morning and we have to get her to work. So let's see how this goes. Jen is here sleeping. I can see she's super hungry. She needs some social and she is super dirty. She needs to take a shower. So let's get on that. I'm gonna have her take a brisk shower so she can be energized because I don't think Emmett has a coffee maker. Emmett let us use his shower and Jen's getting ready for work. I don't know why she's crying. I think she's regretting um, getting high last night, but sis, this is not that big of a deal. Calm down. <laughs> She's over here brushing her teeth. I don't know why Emma is coming into the bathroom while I'm trying to brush my teeth. You see, you see I was getting ready for work. <laughs> it's the lack of personal space for me. <laughs> Jen is feeling really uncomfortable. She says that she has shampoo in her eyes, <laughs> the top 10 bathing betrayals, okay. Um, she's hungry and I think this is worst day ever, of course. Um, so I'm gonna get her a little snack because we don't have time to make breakfast. We got to get to work So I think I'm just going to get her a a kibo. I think that's how you say it Okay, we're gonna eat this little bit of breakfast and then I'll see you guys at work We made it to work and Genevieve is feeling super angry. She's stomping in this bitch <laughs> like This music should make her feel better. Yep. There we go. She's energized <laughs> We're gonna start tending this massage chair. Oh my god, and I think this sim already wants a uh, something. I've noticed when it's slow, a lot of employees just start asking for shit. <laughs> so we're giving this guy a hand massage. Uh-uh, he didn't even give us a tip. I'm pissed. <laughs> I've gotten pretty far in the aspiration, so I've made $799 so far out of 5,000. I think I'm making some good progress, and we've had um, four promotions of uh, self-care on the items. I'm actually gonna do that right now again. Let me go ahead and promote myself on Instagram. Cute, okay. You guys, I'm so freaking hyped because now we can do manicures and pedicures. I'm so excited. This is all we've been waiting for. So I'm gonna do a manicure. Let me see who's nearby. Ooh, okay, I wanna do it on Jade. She looks cute. Okay, I'm asking if she wants to come and get a manicure by me. Yes, okay. We gotta pick her style. Um, I think she has black nails right now, so I kind of want to do something similar because that's like in her style range But maybe we could put a little rhinestone on it. Ooh, okay, we're doing her nails right now She has like these black nails with the white tips. I think we're gonna do like the black with the little rhinestone on it It's gonna be super cute. I can't wait to see how they turn out. Yay. She's tipping us. Yes We got a tip. We got a tip of $46. Yes, I'm glad wait. Let me see what your nails look like sis. Hold up, hold up, nobody showed me. She wasn't trying to show me her nails, but this is what they look like. They're super cute, I love it. Um, I'm gonna do another manicure on, ooh, Aileen is here. We'll do one on her. Dad, she's over here getting a massage, and I was like, no, 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 you need a manicure. <laughs> Let me take care of your nails. <laughs> she's really looking like, bitch, I know you didn't just steal my client. Okay, um, she's kind of on the more tomboy side, so I think I'm gonna go with these black stiletto nails. Don't worry, Aileen, we gonna get your nails right. Look at her, she don't even have any nail beds right now. <laughs> don't worry, these are gonna be so cute. Let me take care of you, girl. Sit down in my chair. <laughs> this is what Aileen's set is looking like. It looks cute, it's like a little black ombre moment. Love that for her. <gasps> oh my God, did she tip us? Yes, 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 she tips us $40. <laughs> We've never done any pedicures before, so I'm kind of curious to see what Genevieve is gonna think about messing with people's toes. So I think I'm gonna give one pedicure for the last client of the day. Okay, I'm giving it to this client here, and I think I'm just gonna give white toes. We're letting the dogs soak before we take care of them. Okay, Jen's taking care of the dogs. It doesn't seem like she's having a bad time doing it. I think as long as it's nails, she's okay. Maybe massages might be different though. <laughs> Look her blocky ass toes. <laughs> I do not want to get that um, foot override though because 
I think they're too detailed and it gets a little freaky. So I'm okay with the blocks. So why did this lady just walk out without paying me? And we didn't even get to see what her toes look like. Cause she's in these stanky ass slippers. I'm pissed. Megan, count your fucking days, bitch. <laughs> Jen is feeling good after this day of work, even though that little stinky bitch stole money from us. <laughs> Karma's gonna get her ass, don't worry. Um, I think I wanna go out with some girls tonight. We'll see where the night takes us. After work, we hit Chloe up and she said she was going to dinner with a few friends and invited us to join, so that's where we are now. I think this table outside would be super cute to sit at, so I wanna sit here. It is so freaking pretty outside. All of these beautiful pink trees. Oh my gosh, I love it. And then we have a bar out here as well. It's such a cute vibe out here. All right, everyone is seated here at the table. So I'm going to show you all of Chloe's friends that she introduced us to. Here we have Naomi. This is Kimmy. And we all know my neighbor, Chloe. I was really thinking that they should go out tonight. So I wanted to do a little pregame and eat before we go out. Okay, so after they finished eating, I sent them out to the club and they're gonna do some toast for a great night. They're gonna have so much fun tonight. Oh my gosh, so you're not gonna believe who's here. Remember in episode one of Genevieve how I explained that Genevieve knew the building owner and he hooked her up with a discount for her apartment complex? Well, this is actually him. This is Eugene O'Neill and he owns the entire apartment complex. He's super, super rich. He owns a lot of property in San Mishuno and I'm gonna see if he can buy me and my girls a drink. She's doing what she does best and she's finessing this man. <laughs> And we're gonna get a drink now. Of course he said yes to buying us drinks because Jen is that girl. All the girls' drinks are coming out and they look so good. So remember how I said that Genevieve was a big daddy's girl and everything in her life was usually handed to her? Well, it's time for that to come into play again because trying to save up money for this nail salon and do fun things is really hard. So I thought the best thing for Genevieve would be a sugar daddy. And um, Eugene, it looks like you're in the running, buddy. I think he would be an amazing sugar daddy and I would love for Genevieve to take advantage of him. So in order for me to ask him to be my sugar daddy, I need to get my romance up with him. So I'm gonna just start flirting with him, make him feel good, and then hopefully he'll become my sugar daddy. I have Genevieve talking to him and flirting with him, gassing him up so we can ask him to be our sugar daddy soon. We gotta butter him up first. Okay, we're about to leave because it's like 7 a.m. in the morning, but we wanted to make sure he remembered us with that hug. Oh, he went in for two. Okay. <laughs> oh, look at her. She's hungry. Oh, wait. Do you want to take us out for brunch, maybe? It looked like a yes. It's a yes. <laughs> Okay, we made it to the restaurant. They are looking over the menu and I was thinking of making this into a date. So hopefully we can butter him up enough to get our relationship high and make him our sugar daddy. Okay, he said yes. Yay. What the? He wants to be best friends. Um, no, thank you. <laughs> no, thank you. We're not on that level. Strictly transactional. Okay, I'm gonna order a mimosa, of course, for breakfast, and he can have a macchiato, or actually a cappuccino. I feel like that would be what he would order. And I'm gonna have Genevieve order the French toast, and he can have the pancakes. He wants to take things to the next level. Will Genevieve be his girlfriend? What is wrong with him? No, you are not gonna be my man. I'm sorry. No, thank you. <laughs> okay, the waiter's here and we're gonna order our food. I don't wanna ruin things with him, but I don't want to be his girlfriend. I wanna be your sugar baby. So I'm going to have to try to butter him up, but in some type of way that's gonna not have to give him any sugar. <laughs> so let's try. May I just do a bold pickup line. Oh my gosh, she's thinking that she already doesn't like him. <laughs> he is falling in love with her though. Okay, I'm trying my hardest to make him our sugar daddy without giving him any sugar. And this is tough, but 
I think I'm going to do some slow dancing with him and maybe whisper seductively in his ear to get him fired up. And hopefully that will work. But I just don't want him to ask us to be his girlfriend anymore. <laughs> I don't know how to lead him on without him trying to move too fast. Okay, so we're just slow dancing, but his hand is a little close. It is a little closer. This is going to be tough. I tell you, this is going to be tough. He's not an ugly looking guy. I just think that I am not trying to make him our man. Like that's not, that's not the plan. We just want his money. Tell me why we're waiting for our food and I go to the kitchen and I'm like, um, where's the chef? Where's the chef? Uh, nobody is here to cook the food. I'm pissed. <laughs> I fixed my mods and it got my chefs to show back up, but this Sim is literally acting like he got called into work. <laughs> like, bro, you were supposed to be here regardless. Shut up. Our food has come out. I have the French toast and Eugene has the pancakes. Eugene is feeling Genevieve so much. I'm gonna have him order a glass of champagne for them. We're gonna get some rosé, $340. All right, they brought out the champagne, so I'm gonna grab a drink. Let's grab one together. Oh my God, this is his second time asking me to be his girlfriend. Um, no, I'm sorry. Okay, I think I've got my relationship high enough so we can ask him to be our sugar daddy. Okay, let's see. <gasps> yes, we can. Okay, let's see what he says. Ah, <laughs> oh, <Ed Roy. laughs> Congratulations, your demand has been accepted. You can ask your daddy to give you his gold credit card, but be careful, don't take too much money out. A certificate has been delivered to your household inventory. It confirms your sugar relationship. Make him happy and he will satisfy your traveling and shopping requests. Okay, I think I'm gonna just butter him up some more. I'm gonna tell him, you just smell so good. Okay, your hands are so soft. And let me do the other one. Your smile is adorable. Okay, I'm gonna ask for his credit card now. Ask him for the gold credit card. She got the credit card. Genevieve finally owns the gold credit card. She can get out a lot of cash and go shopping. Don't enjoy too much, by the way. If Genevieve decides to break up with her sugar daddy, he will take his credit card back. And look at his card he gave us. First of all, we're gonna go shopping. Second of all, we need to take some money out. And third of all, we need to go on a vacation. Okay, looking at her moodlet, she has a ton. So she has, ah, looking at those bubbles from the wine. An irresistible smile from complimenting daddy. Genevieve is so proud to have a sugar daddy who takes care of his denture. <laughs> okay. Um, hmm, your hands are so soft. Genevieve is so excited to see her daddy's hands. So soft. I don't, I think she's excited to see her daddy's money, but okay. Um, <laughs> whenever I see this handsome body, I shiver. Genevieve is so excited to be near her sugar daddy. Both of us <laughs> in the hot tub. Are you okay with that, my daddy? Um, I feel like this mod is not really understanding what a sugar daddy is because you're not really trying to get your sugar taken. Daddy smells so good and his simlins too. Okay, this sounds like Genevieve. Genevieve feels confident beside her sugar daddy, his simlins actually. Okay, makes sense. He said yes. Genevieve is so proud that she convinced this daddy. She can now ask for his gold credit card and enjoy all aspects of this relationship. If daddy gets boring, Genevieve could end the relationship easily. Perfect. So, how much money should we take out? Mm, I'll just say 5,000. I don't want to ask too much. I'm just going to go ahead and oh, take this, put this in my inventory while we're oh, here. <laughs> Somebody's got to drink it. <sighs> so, we just made it back home, and yes, our electricity has been turned off. They even turned off the fucking lights in the hallway for some reason. Good thing our sugar daddy gave us $5,000 because we gotta pay some bills. Like, every day I'm paying bills around this bitch. $5,000. Just the amount our sugar daddy paid, and now, bye bye, 5000 I think I'm gonna end the night off with a bubble bath and I'm probably gonna do one with soaks. Maybe like the oatmeal honey soak one. It's like clockwork. As soon as we got in this bathtub, Chloe's bitch ass started blasting some metal music. Like, didn't we already have this conversation? I, I don't have time for it right now. I She's trying to get me out of my zen right now and <laughs> I'm not gonna let her.
Oh, also, I wanted to show you a few little upgrades I did to Genevieve's room. I gave her this cork board and I'm starting to put some Polaroid pictures on it. So uh, right now I just have her and Nutella on it, but hopefully we'll get some more soon. And downstairs, I added these frames to put Genevieve's family portraits in and it just takes it to the next level. I think it's so much cuter than just the blank canvas. Jen is just sending some text messages and then I'm going to put her to bed. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. This one was a bit short, but don't worry, next episode is going to be a long one. If you like this video, please make sure to thumbs up, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye!